Asante. Mambo. Bagamoyo. Bagamoyo panda ikashuke bunzi ndio unapata gari za Bagamoyo. Huko za Bagamoyo hakuna. Hey guys, what's up? Uh, I'm in a bus heading to Bonjo, Bunjo, yeah, Bunjo. Then uh, we head to Bagamoyo because uh, there are no buses that are coming from the restaurant to. Bagamoyo straight so you have to first go to Bunjo then you head to Bagamoyo and from Dar es Salaam to Bunjo it's 1000 Tanzanian shillings so and yeah so let's go see you in Bunjo and yeah we shall see how much is it from Bunjo to Bagamoyo uh, I'm going to spend my day in Bagamoyo and what I know is gonna be fine and amazing Bagamoyo Mambo Mambo In Bagamoyo I've just arrived right now and uh, it took us something like uh, two hours because the bus was overstopping but um, I'm here now which is so 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 amazing and uh, from um, from uh, Dar es Salaam town to Bagamoyo it's something like uh, let me see something like three thousand Tanzanian shillings so anyways let's enjoy this journey together ah okay Okay. Wait a moment. Hey, wait a moment. Okay, thank you. Anajua. Yeah, una mchumba. Mchumba unaye? Ah. Sasa mchumba vizuri. Una. Mchumba. I don't understand. How we really with you? Boyfriend. Hey, you asking me whether I have a boyfriend? Una mzuri kuliko mmoja wapo hapa. Hao hapa wamfikii boyfriend wako. That what? <laughs> Boyfriend, you are Missouri, come on. You are my boyfriend. Yeah. This one? No, this one is not. <laughs> Bye. Uh, anyway, I got a border, and let us tour around this beautiful Baga Moya. So, in case you want to. To go deep into the history of Tanzania, you're welcome, you're welcome to Bagamoyo actually. This is a, a very historical town here in Tanzania. So this is my
Uh, in Bagamoyo, mm. the town we call Bagamoyo, but the, the name Bagamoyo is coming during the Seven Island. So oh. before that time, this place was called in another name, it's not Bagamoyo. It was called what? By the time the town was called Pumbuji. Pumbuji? Yes, I want to show you the first Pumbuji place. Mm -hmm. What's the meaning of Pumbuji? <laughs> Pumbuji, the mean of Pumbuji is wetland and fertility land. It's wetland? Yes, and fertility. And fertility. So this uh, land was fertile? Yes, by the time. By that in time? In nature. Oh, in nature. That's why uh, the, uh, the, the local people or the indigenous people, mm. they want to plant their own crops, mm. but they don't put any kind of fertility, ah, which means the, the land has The nature. land was fertile. Yes, itself. in nature itself. Mm. That's why they call it Pumbuji. Pumbuji? Yes. White land and the fertility land. Mm. Okay. So before the Bagamoro, mm. this land was called Pumbuji. Yes. So claim it. Pumbuji. Okay. Pumbuji. So, <laughs> so uh, do you know? But later the name was changed. To what? To Bagamoyo. No. Uh, Pumbuji is starting around the 18th century, 19th, uh, 9th century, up to 10th century. Long years ago, by the time. So the local people they were here, mm. and uh, the local people is the only three ethnic group. Only three. Which one and which one? Uh, the first one was called Zaramo, mm -hmm. and the second one was called Ikwele. Ikwele. Kwele. Kwele. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the, and the third one was called uh, Doe. Doe. Yes. So Zaramo, Kwele. Kwele. Doe. Okay. The local people, indigenous people. Who were here? You, yes. Oh. In 9th century, 10th century, they are staying here in Bagumo. Mm. By the time, the place was a Pumbuji. Mm -hmm. But uh, during the Celebrity and the Ivory, the name is coming Bagamoyo. But before Bagamoyo, the name was coming Kaole. Kaole. I want to show you nowadays, we call Kaole Ruins. Ah, okay, okay. I think at the man would point to Gunachu there. So I want to take off that. <laughs> So, but during the Celebrity and the Ivory, Bagamo was the central way, or central road. So slaves were collected from Ntilie, this way, in the western part of Tanganyika. Mm. From uh, the one point was called the, nowadays we call uh, Ujiji Kigoma, mm -hmm. and then Tabora, and they cross, the slave master, they're going to cross the Lake Tanganyika, and they're going to find another slave from Congo, from Zambia, from part of Rwanda and also Burundi, even around the Uganda, mm. when across there, they're gonna find some slaves. Some slaves, yeah. Yes. Mm. So from there, they came straight up the one point known as Ujiji Kigoma, the western part of Tanganyika or Tanzania nowadays. So after arriving in Ujiji, so Ujiji was the center for the slave masses. They wanna collect their own slaves from the different part, and then they wanna collect them to the Ujiji Kigoma. Mm. Before starting their way from there up here in Bagamo. Ah, okay. So from there, the slave masters by the time, any slave master has own slaves. Ah, okay. And he collects own slaves. Mm. And uh, one, uh, one start to, uh, to walk on the way, among the slave masters, they can't identify his own slaves. So how they do, they want to find some symbols to put them slaves. Oh, so they used to mark them. Yes. Mm. And by the time the slave master, they're looking for the people, but also they're looking for the mineral. Even the ivory, they're gonna find it. Mm. And then there is nobody who may carry it, it's only slaves. So they carry it. Mm. And they came straight up here. But among the slaves, they wanna die on the way. They, they die on the way because they walk on the way from there up here and they wanna spend at least six up to eight months. They walk on the world. Six. Six months to eight months. So this one building was built by the Germany, but the first was used by the Arab as a temporary slave camp. After the Arab, the German came in, and this one was used by the German also as a German military base. Mm. And after the Germany, Tanganyika was taken by the British after the First World War, mm. and this was used as a prison. Ah, so British. this building was built first by the Arabs, Arab, second then by the German, German, then the British. British yes. Okay. And but they are used for their own purpose, especially Germany, British, and the Arabs. So by the time this was the watching tower for the German soldier. Ah, so this was the what? Watching tower. The oh, tower for the this German was a tower. Yes, for ah. the German soldier. So they want to stand up here. So they used to stand up here. Yes. Wow. 
Uh -huh. So they used to stand up yes. here and with the guns yes. to look for the enemy. Yes, that's why they want to tie some cannon from oh, here. Oh yeah, I can see, yeah. Yes, so they touch from here. And this is the ocean direction. Ah, ocean is here, but the ocean uh, is down uh, there. Yeah, down there. So uh, they believe, and by the time uh, they make sure that the ocean are the main way transport. They want to believe themselves, the main way transport. So anybody before a year must to cross over there. So it become easy for them to fight immediately before. But by the time there is no tree like this one, you see nowadays, you are, these trees coming this time around. Ah, okay. So uh, here in Tanganyika, now is Tanzania, but uh, uh, Tanganyika was getting independent mm -hmm. in 1961. Okay. That's when you got your independence, yes. 1961. Here in Tanganyika. In yes, and then he, there is one place we call uh, Zanzibar Island. Or Zanzibar Island. Mm -hmm. The Zanzibar Island got, got independence in 1963. So that's why in 1964, Tanganyika, Manland, and Zanzibar Island they, they unite together. Mm -hmm. Now is the public of Tanzania, we call Tanzania. Tanzania. Yes, so okay. this is uh, United Tanganyika Malanda and the Transbaraga. So during the German or during the Arab colony, mm. this is a place where the slave master used to keep slaves down here. So, so they want to keep here. So slave. they used to keep the slaves yes, here? Yes, so this was a slave camp by the time. Ah. During the slave colony rivalry. So the slave master, they keep slaves here. But by the time there was no war like this. Mm. The wars coming before during the German. Hey, the German are the one who constructed the walls. Yes, the wall. And then, you know the German, when they're here, the German, they don't like slave trade. Oh, the German didn't like slave trade. Yeah, so mm. which means they want to apply the anti-slavery campaign. So they want to stop slave trade. Mm, slave but, trade, yeah. Yes, they want to stop slave trade. But stop slave trade, but they want to apply slavery. slavery. So they don't like some if you can to take them outside of Tanganyika. Because uh, the German, they came here after the Berlin Conference. Do you hear about that? Yeah, the Berlin Conference. Yes, yeah. so uh, in 1886, the German was here in Tanganyika, especially here in Bagamoyo. Mm. So this bag they built the wall, and they make sure that the building was the German uh, military base. But this point here would used to be the German at the assembly point. Oh, for the... Practice during the morning and during the evening. Ah. So they make practice from here. And stay here for the leader. Video, by the way. Hope you're enjoying the history of Tanganyika, Tanzania, which is Tanzania right now. Is it called Tanzania, Tanzania? Okay, let's go. Is it called Tanzania, Tanzania? Tanzania. It's called Tanzania. Yes. Tanzania. Some people call it Tanzania. Some people call it Tanzania. It's the same. Yeah, it's all the same. Of the people, but the yeah. Tanzania, the same. Once again, Tanzania, the same. Yeah. Yeah. So it's Benny. How do you like to speak? How do you like to speak? Uh, yes. It? Tanzania, Tanzania. <laughs> <laughs> so we are going to check out the fish market. What's wrong with the boat? What the fish for the fish? So for the fishing. No, 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 the other one. The other one, you don't want to push. Take the ocean. Yeah. Wow, Liverpool. <laughs> this one has Liverpool on it. <laughs> ah, the, the owner is a supporter uh, of Liverpool. <laughs> Liverpool. Mambo. Hey. How are you? Fine. You're fine? Yeah. But uh, you're refusing me to record Muzei. Eh? Yeah. I'm not a little. 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 I'm not a little.
<laughs> you can buy chai. Hey. Chai alfutano. That is 500. Miatano. Hey, chai miatano. Apa. Nini? Just listen. Chai ya miatano. Okay, you're welcome. Okay, you're welcome. Okay, bye, Mze. Eh, bye. Hmm? Hmm? What's your name? Why? Eh, my name, Josie. From Uganda. Uganda. Yeah. What is your name? Uh, your name is Christian. Your name is Christian. Christian yeah. Eh, Christian. Nice to meet you, Christian. Okay. Okay. Power. Don't worry. Okay. Okay. Bye, Mze. Eh. <laughs> so they're constructing this new boat. Yes, this one. Here. This one is new, yeah. Yes, new. Whoa, Noah's Ark. <laughs> wow. This looks so cute. Guys, are you ready to go on this boat? Ah. Uh, the big one. The big. Yeah, it's really big. <laughs> ah. Wow. <laughs> go up. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> finally. Mambo. Mambo. Best jambo. Poa. Mzee Mambo. Abadi. Hey. <laughs> so this is fresh. Check them because they are nails. Yeah, nails. Ah. Yes. Ah, no, I won't go there. I'll just be here. Okay, so guys, this is how they construct a boat. As you're seeing, I'm not going to go down because uh, they have told me that there are a little bit of nails and I have to remove my shoes. I've removed my shoes actually, I think because it's not that safe. And Mose is there busy grilling. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, this is a huge, 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 huge boat. Yeah. Noah's Ark. <laughs> oh my God. Where you come from? Me? Yeah. Come from Uganda. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh. <laughs> You, you guys hold for me. No problem. Hold for me. Oh my god. <laughs> no, hold, 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 hold. hold. This is the fish market. Let me turn the camera and I show you. So this morning, mm -hmm. and uh, the, 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 the fisherman who came during the night or during the morning mm. now is still disappeared. They're gonna finish their work. Oh, they are finished yeah, selling their selling fish. The fish yeah. Ah. And uh, nowadays the people are waiting. Those fishermen who gone during the morning. Mm. So they are waiting here around the three. Two, they're coming back here. Oh, the so they are those here. guys who went in the morning they to bring, fish. Yes. So they will bring their fish at yes, three to sell three, here. Yeah, to sell ah. here. The fish one. Is the official port yeah, in Bagamoyo? Bagamoyo. Bagamoyo, there is no another port here. Oh, but, this is the official uh, is port. The official one. And uh, mm, the government, mm -hmm. nowadays on, a, uh, on the process mm. for building another port here in Bagamoyo. Oh, they're in the process yeah, of constructing another port. Port here, ah. but it's not here, the place here now. 
Oh, it's another yeah, place. Yeah, I'll find another place for the, the, the nation deep, the deep place. Oh, where yeah, the ocean yeah, is kind of deep. Kind of deep so yeah. Construct there, mm. and it's outside of the town because this place here is small. Yeah, it's re yeah, it's yeah, really so really can't small. Build, uh, construct port here for the small. Because there are so many people around here. There's some settlement for the people. Yeah, so yeah. So we to find another place. A, A bigger place. place. Yes, eighty kilometers from here. This one direction, the southern direction. Ah. Yes. Why does that say Marafik Marafuku? We prohibited it. Eh. Yeah, that's the prohibited. You get a short code down there. So ah. Like some, people. some people used yeah. to urinate. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Okay. Okay. Ah. Those people who don't say excuse me, I wanna. Those people who don't like using the toilet. Yeah. So some people don't like. <laughs> they used to urinate. They hide there the wall. And start urinating. Yeah. <laughs> so that's why. Ah. Warning. So, um, how many years are these buildings, if I ask? Yeah, first, as I told you before, in the year where the building was built, mm. in 1895, mm. was built. So, since that time up now, the building is here. Mm. So, there's so many years once we Oh, yeah. Okay. 1895 up now. Okay. Yeah. So they don't use these offices anymore? No, they built another one. Eh, so one. this is the, yeah, new they one. the new one. These are the new offices. Yes. And these are the old ones that yeah, were built one. by yes. the German. Yes, so three years ago they were, they were here. Oh, they were yeah. here three years ago. What? Yes. They were still here, working from here. <laughs> but they decided to what? shift. <laughs> ah, they decided they to, to shift. shift. Ah, these new ones yes. here. Yeah. Ah, okay. Mambo, Maji, Maji, Two, Mini. Oh, Asante. At least this one is better. From which country? Yeah. From Uganda. Yeah. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go You know the first immigrant people who came along the coastal line of the East Africa mm. are the people from the Persian Gulf, the Shalaz people. Mm. So, so they settled in here in, Kia, Bagamoro. in Bagamoyo. But another place starting from here, here in Bagamoyo, one place known as Kirwa. Oh, so that's why I'm like the history of Tanzania starts in Bagamoyo. In Bagamoyo, Bagamoyo. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. That's why he even wants to talk about the, the first immigrant mm. here in Bagamoyo. Mm. When you talk about the slave trade, here in, in Bagamoyo, yeah. When you talk about the uh, uh, colonial administration, especially German and the British, mm. starting here in Bagamoyo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even wants to talk about the missionary, when he came the missionary to do the Christian religion and the abolition slave trade, starting here in Bagamoyo. Bagamoyo, yeah, yeah. So each and every the history of Tanzania. It starts Tanzania. from Bagamoyo. Yes. So guys, you should come to Bagamoyo because this is where the history starts from. If you're so interested, if you're so interested in history, and you're so interested in the history of Tanzania, you should come to Bagamoyo and see these amazing uh, memorial places. When the first immigrant was here, they built the mosque, the first one. They built the mosque to make sure that the, those people want to pray here. And uh, uh, do you know the principle of the Muslim? Before into the mosque, must get some water. To find some water, the priest of the Muslim. Before you go to the mosque, must get some water to clean their own parts of the body. Be clean, and then they're going to pray inside. So how they do, by the time they don't have water here, it's only salt water from the sea. So how they do, they want to dug some water well here, by the front of the mosque, still nearby. So the, the, uh, the, the water well here was dug around the 13th century. So in this, since that time of now, the water is still there inside. And uh, uh, since the time of now, the water is still there, and uh, 
the one of the, this one water while here does not increase or increase even the length. It's only even the dry season. So, so this water is something like what? Holy water. They call, Ho like they call it holy water? holy water? How long has it been here? Oh my god. So, oh. 13 centuries. So 13 so centuries. Now. So wow. there's so many centuries. Even six centuries now is still many. Mm. So uh, why they call holy water? Because the, the water even during the rain season. Even during the, uh, the, the the dry season, it doesn't dry. Yeah, it doesn't dry, and uh, the, 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 the the level or the amount of water is still remains normal in that mm. time of now. You see, nowadays some people wanna use it for the for their own removing some bad lags for themselves, for their ah. own things, for getting shower, for cleaning their own part of the body, for drinking, so whatever. It depends on you for your own thing. Mm. Yeah, so it's called holy water. Holy you water. Most, I told you before. Where they place the man was in Kenya, mm -hmm. up from here, at the top of the building, up there. So this was the mosque? Yes, there was a mosque. Ah. Yeah, but uh, uh, for the faith of the people, even nowadays they want to use the mosque. Oh, so people even yeah, come here and pray? Yeah, even nowadays they going inside on a prayer. Uh -huh. You got the holy power? <laughs> Who are you? Eh? Me? Hi! How are you? You're... Nice to meet you to your who? I'm Tanya. Tanya, nice to meet you. Okay. Eh? This is from this boy is from class to M. Uh -huh. This boy is and this boy is class to K. They are your friends. What's your name? What's your name? My name? I'm Josie. And 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 my and I'm in class two K and then she her she's in class two K. They're all your friends. friends. They're all your friends. Yeah, they're all my friends. Okay, can you say hi to everyone? Hi. <laughs> my name? I'm Josie. Josie. Yeah. What is your name? Said. Said. Oh. What is your name? My name? Josie. How do you spell it? Josie. J O S E Y. Okay. okay. <laughs> wait, wait. Yeah? Hi. 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 I'm Papa Pink. Hi. Ah! <laughs> I'm George Pink. <laughs> I'm Daddy Pink. Oh! I'm Daddy Pink. I'm Mommy Pink. I'm, I'm, I'm George. Oh, these kids are so sweet. You're George? I'm Pink. Your Mommy Pink? Oh! back to Dar es Salaam and uh, it was really a nice time here in Bagamoyo and if you really want to know the history of Tanzania it starts from Bagamoyo so once you come to Tanzania don't forget coming to Bagamoyo trust me you love this town you love the his all the historical places the history uh, starting from the the, uh, the Arabs going to the Germans going to the British so anyway guys uh, I'm ending this video from here and uh, see you in my next one bye